इक्कीसवीं सदी में बायो एथिक्स का क्या रोल है जैसे कि आप अपने इर्द गिर्द देख सकते हैं कि इक्कीसवीं सदी में बायो एथिक्स सबसे ज्यादा हेल्थ केयर के फील्ड में आगे बढ़ी इट इज नॉट अबाउट द हॉस्पिटल ओनली इट इज अबाउट द हेल्थ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन अबाउट द हेल्थ इंस्टीट्यूशन अबाउट द हेल्थ कम्युनिटीज अबाउट द कम्युनिकेशन एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन टेक्नोलॉजीज सो रेपिड एडवांसेज टेक्स प्लेस इन द हेल्थ केयर टेक्नोलॉजी Now couples can even decide that whether they can have a handicapped child or not whether they want abortion or not so this become ethical for some communities but not for other communities in uh, in 21st century organization and global bioethics ye do naam bioethics ke sath jode gaye kyunki bioethics baghair kisi organization ke nahi chal sakti aur agar koi bioethical issue raise hota hai it becomes a global bioethics now there are three principles of bioethics which were introduced by toms and james one of them was autonomy the second one was beneficence and the third one was justice now what is autonomy this is what we are we cannot go against people wishes for example jaise ki maine aapko pehle ek example di ke informed consent yani ke ijazat nama patient se sign hoga uske guardian se sign hoga to tab ja ke ek doctor jo hai wo aage surgery kar sakega even treatment can only be start with the signed informed consent now with the first principle autonomy two important principles were introduced the first one was non maleficence and the third one was beneficence that we are responsible for the betterment of other of our society of other societies as well for example it is the responsibility of the physician to give good drugs to the patients which are good for their health but not harmful because some drugs have greater side effects as compared to the other drugs now being ethical it means i am following laws so justice is very important for example physicians can refer a drug which is very much expensive so only small population can take benefit from it not the whole population so it is the responsibility of the hospital to get proper fundings from the funding agencies so that such medicines can be provided to everyone so this is all about the bioethics in 21st century